So here's it parsing um, some simple JSON. Only took a couple of milliseconds there. I've posted a four megabyte file in there and from a fresh reset, it's taking um, 800 milliseconds. This is how it works. If you include json.async.js, it just has a function called parse async and it, if web workers are included, it will include a file called json.worker. Inside that, all it does is it picks up um, a data packet, parses it, and posts the parse JSON back. So here inside parse async, I'm picking up some string data, I'm posting it to the other thread, and um, I'm just collecting the parse JSON and firing the callback. This is just an actual implementation. You can see the, the jitterness. On the right is using the async version, and it's just a lot more smoother. It still takes the same amount of time to load, but it's just um, not, not main thread blocking.